Hello everyone. This is Judy coming to you from my scrapbook loft. And I am here today. Um, I am um, on um, Antonio Makes Creative Squad. Hi Antonio. And um, I've got my new digital kit for this month. And I chose the Christmas um, I think maybe the new kits may be Christmas. I'm not sure. But I'll link his uh, digital shop below in the description box and his YouTube channel, his Facebook channel, uh, Facebook page, and his Instagram page. All will be linked below. You all, I picked the poinsettia and galore. Poinsettia galore. Here, we call them pineys, okay? Um, no, we don't call poinsettias pineys. Good grief. <laughs> it's peonies we call pineys. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> Sorry about that. Poinsettias. We, we call them poinsettias. Duh. Um, this is the poinsettia galore. Uh, collection here. There are 11 pages. I'm still printing one out. You all look. Let's get one at a time here. Look at these poinsettias. Aren't they gorgeous? Absolutely gorgeous. And I like that he's got blue in here. I don't normally work with blue. So this is going to be interesting to see what I can do with the blue but yeah I'm going to because I just think it's beautiful a beautiful digital here are the tags um, I love this blue with the pine uh, bile, bile going through it and the fern leaves and the ho uh, holly berries he's got red and blue and white I think that's very pretty and then look at these with the poinsettias in them. I just love them. And I printed them out on 65 pound cardstock. I love, 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 love this one. The poinsettias with the cream background and the um, holly berries and the holly leaves and the pine branches. Oh, I just love it. And then look at this one, you all. I just, I don't know why my printer uh, always cuts off the end of it, but it does. But I can work with it. I just love this. And then he has these. This is what I'm printing off in the navy blue. He has these in three different colors. He's got them in a cream uh, mocha-like color with white. Then he's got it in red. And I run out of ink on this one, but I didn't throw it away because I might be able to use those. Not the purple looking things, but aren't those just gorgeous? May the Christmas season bring you special moments and happy memories. Wishing you a Christmas of smiles and love that will last all year. Here is to the new year bringing happy beginnings. And then you've got Believe, Season, Greetings, Christmas, Merry, Merry Christmas, Best of Seasons, and Noel on all of them. I just love those. And then here are the big tags. And my printer cut this one off. And um, I'm going to print this sheet out again because I know I can always use more tags. And I will just fix that one um, to where it matches. So it'll still be usable. And then there's this one with the um, yellow point, yellow cream, um, like they're not, um, I want to say ripe. <laughs> like they've not reached their color yet, their red color, but I know there are cream colored poinsettias, so yeah. And then there's the red one with the 
uh, pine boughs, uh, pine needle branches, some holly berries. I just love this paper. And then here's this one with the um, poinsettias layered here with the poinsettia leaves. Antonio, I just love this paper, this digital paper. Love it. So that's the poinsettia galore. And then this is the Christmas background papers. This one is of all presents. It's of different sizes and shapes. Love that, and I love this one. The poinsettias and the snowflakes. Uh, the pine branches, um, holly leaves and holly berries. Stars, I mean, it's just a Christmas night on this one. Oh, and then the red cardinals and the red poinsettias and the presents, hollies. Love that. And then this blue. Love that. It's got red and blue. So I, I'll be able to work with this with the red. Like I said, I'm, I'm not much with blue, but I'm anxious to see what I come up with for these. I've not got anything in my head yet. I'm going to have to ponder for a little while. Yeah. And then you all look at this one. Beautiful roses. You got rocking horses, ballerinas, ornaments, swans, partridge. It's just, it's just gorgeous. It's just beautiful. I love it. Some more holly berries in here. Pine cones. It's just beautiful. Then, of course, you got your little tin soldier. The nutcracker. Isn't he cute? And then this one, you all. I love this one, too. With the roses and the Christmas lights and the pine needles in here. I love the muted... Uh, the way he did the muted colors for the roses and the leaves. And the focus is on this centerpiece. It's just gorgeous. Oh, this one. These two I printed out on copy paper. And I decided, nah. <laughs> but I'm not going to throw them away. I might use them on something. I thought, nah, I need those on um, 110 pounds. So that's the um, Christmas background. And then you all, I told him the two um, kits. Uh, he gives us two kits a month. And, uh, and I told him that I wanted uh, the letters to Santa. And uh, so he let me have it too. Thank you, Antonio. I just think the, this is just so, so cute. It's the gingerbread, and this is the envelope, this is the letter, and these are the postcards. And, um, yeah, I just love this. Um, I had to have it. It's just so cute. And I thank you so much, Antonio. Um, He's even got the uh, Nutcracker Soldiers on here. He's got a globe with wings on it there for the world travel of Santa. He's got a Santa Claus stamp on there. He's got December the 24th stamped on that because we all know that's when Santa makes his rounds. And it finally finished. Here's the blue for the uh, Poinsettia uh, Galore. Uh, digital. Isn't that pretty? Love it. And then the postcards are so cute. He's got a 
uh, like a pine cone bough, pine needle, pine branch bough here. Merry Christmas. Letter to Santa, dear Santa, to Santa and from. I just love this. Yes, I do. And then this one that says, this is me. And there's to put a picture. And it says, my name is. And my, my parents would tell you I've been nice or naughty. I think that's so cute. And then what I would like most. Merry Christmas and P.S. And then there's a line here for some writing. Love it. I just had to have this. Yes, I did. You all, if you're not subbed to Antonio Makes, and I will uh, list all of the Creative Squad members in the uh, description box below. Please go over and uh, show them all some crafty love and uh, see what they create for Antonio. Um, like I said, I'm still pondering. I have, uh, well, 24 days. <laughs> uh, so, um, I'm still, I'm still thinking. If y'all have any suggestions or anything that you'd like to see me make, just put it in the description box below. I want to uh, thank each and every one of you for visiting with me, taking time out of your day and, and sharing it with me today. Thank you so very much. Hugs to you from me, and God bless.